And there's a lovely Chrissy Blair. Thank you, Chrissy. Brooklyn and Vanessa with us as well. Chris Shotko, number 10 in the world at 185 pounds. All right, gentlemen, here present. we go. First round, you ready? First round, you ready? Taking on the 14th ranked Uriah Hall. Shotko getting off early. He's in gray. Jotko vs. Hall, UFC Fight Night 116, Pittsburgh. Hall did his MMA training at Extreme Couture for this camp, but spent a lot of time at the UFC for the Lawrence Institute for his strength and conditioning, physical therapy, nutrition. Jotko with a lead uppercut, falls it over the left hand. Jotko is pressuring. Jotko heavy on the pressure, and the reason why you're seeing that is because that helps keep... Hall from throwing all the kicks that he wants to throw. If you get, if you smother Hall, if you keep him on his heels, you can kind of limit some of his tools, and that's what Jocko's looking for. But he's got to keep the in and out movement like he's doing. If you try to run straight out on Hall, he can counter you. And as we're seeing here, Jocko's moving in, out, in, out, and that's just to keep <coughs> Hall from reading the counters. Hall was slated to get a fight with Anderson Silva last year at UFC 198. Silva had to pull out. So the last appearance for Hall ended up being later that year in November against Gegard Mousasi. Which you lost. Something you're used to seeing out of Hall is him kind of sit back, wait a little bit, and then out of nowhere yeah. comes some explosive, crazy strike that he's just read that nobody else is seeing but him. So don't blink for one second because <clears throat> both these gentlemen are extremely fast. Nice inside leg kick there for Uriah Hall. Front kick. Shotko not as active as last time out against David Branch as we've become accustomed to seeing. Well, here we got Hall switching stance all the time, giving you different looks. Right now, we already see him use the teep kick and the inside kick. Looks like he's setting up that right high kick for Jocko being a southpaw. He's great. <laughs> Ooh. Ooh. <laughs> yep, 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 it's gonna be done. It's gonna be done. And Hall needs to tie him up or get on his bike. Get to move it. Let's see what Jocko can do in this top position here. You agree with Jocko's decision here to take the fight down? Well, right now he's doing just fine. I think he had. Hall rocked, so he probably could have done a lot of damage, but Hall's also not very comfortable on his back, so it's not a bad decision to do this. He can really work the clock, do some damage here, see if he can rip this on bar that Hall's given up, see if he can take the back. Ooh, go for the choke. Oh, he's just bringing him down. Non-stop brutality from Jocko since the beginning of this fight. He's come forward hard. He's on a mission in this matchup. Yeah, we expected an urgent Chris Jocko here tonight as he mounts Uriah Hall. Just yeah. over two minutes here to go in round one. And this was just jiu This is going to be over. Until you pass oh. Him now he's taking the back because Hall's given up. The hoops are in. Jocko not much of a submission threat, Don. Just one career win by rear naked choke. Maybe Doesn't mean it can't happen when Come we're on. seeing this kind of a beating going on right now. You were seeing Hall hurt. Hall needs to get his back up against the fence, try to get one of those hooks out go, 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 so that he can get back to his feet. Unless he fights those hooks, Hall is not getting up. That means by the hooks, he has to get one of those feet out from underneath his hips. See how Jocko has the lock now. Good from Hall to stand up. Now he can kind of stop the chokes a little bit easier. Looks like he's recovered. But still receiving damage. <laughs> Jocko, this uses so much energy. I mean, to just squeeze the way he's doing right now. He's going for the choke, yes, but this waste your legs. Oh, he's got oh, it. Oh, he's got it. He's got it. And he doesn't quite have the choke. Nope, he doesn't have it. He did a good job. Now he's he back goes back to the game. He did a good job turning his back. That's why Jocko wasn't able to finish that choke. He had it in, but since Paul turned his back to the mat, he gave up now, and he's still taking damage, but at least he's not choked. Jocko one minute left. He continues to the way on the ground. Oh, Hall reverses. They're standing up. Holy cow. Exhausted from that output. And I'm not quite sure the extent to which Hall has recovered here. Both these guys are letting it all hang out in this first round. Just staying tough. Hall is just defending, not doing much. He's tired. Oh, he hasn't fully recovered yet. Oh. Jocko 
Mexico presses forward, mouth wide open. Ten seconds to go here, round one. And it looks like Uriah is defending really well. Round it's going to be a second round. Holy cow, we didn't expect that. Did not expect that. He survived the one hell of a storm. Shit. He's tired. He really is. Not too much water. Again, that you that that mix and you're just swinging with somebody and you know they're hurt. The takedown just looks so easy and you can't help it. It's like you just want to put them on their back sure. and beating them. Sure. While it might not always be the smartest thing to do, sometimes it just happens and he still won that first round pretty decisively. Paul finally letting off some offense. He's going inside, he's going body. Now look for him to land the high control. Oh, yeah. Take that away. Very busy. Three and a half minutes here to go round two. Jocko taking his time. Body kick followed up by a right hand for Jocko. Jocko is cutting corner. Yep. He hit him. Wow. Holy shit. Came out of nowhere. Wow. Right hand. Right in his face. Holy shit. <laughs> oh, that was good. That was good. He weathered the storm in the first round. Came back in the second. Holy shit. That was amazing. Damn. Right hand. Knocked him out. It just shows you can't ever. <laughs> that was amazing. Hall, 
he's always really, in the fight. Really, really, really. And all he had to do is basically wake up. It's almost like he, he got beat up a little in the first round and said, okay, I'm awake now. I feel good. Yep. I'm ready to put some pressure. He started yeah, putting the pressure back on Jocko and was able to put together his own offense, land the big punch, and get the finish. Beautiful win by Hall. And what a moment for Clayton Hires and the rest that of the That was awesome. Oh.